Hello everyone, thank you so much for stopping by my channel. This is Simply Kiwi. I'm going to do a quick review of the of a stencil that I got from Dollar Tree today um, on a previous manicure that I've done. This is just one of the stencils that you can find at Dollar Tree. And this was of course just a dollar. And I wanted to see how well they work. So I'm going to do it two different ways today. I'm going to use this one. I've already started testing with some of these, but I'm going to use this one, which is uh, flowers. And what I wanted to do first is to basically use it on a stamper. This is one of my old stamps that I use. Um, and I'm going to use it on this one. Um, this is one I don't I no longer use it for my stamping plates, but I'm going to use this one today to test this stencil out. <clears throat> and the polish that I'm using is from uh, Nina Ultra Pro. This is on the pail. And I'm going to use one of these to stamp on this manicure here before I take it off tonight and do something else but I'm going to start by pulling this off this is one thing I didn't like the way it pulls when I was pulling this the other ones from this side it was like trying to stretch out the other stencil but of course I only paid a dollar so what do you expect I'm going to put this stencil on top of this stamper and already I see it's not sticking look at that oh my gosh so this is not gonna work <sighs> okay the next thing I said I was gonna do is just basically put it on my nail and let's see how well it stays on I'm pressing it down on my nail so again it's not pressing very good but I'm gonna try it anyway so I'm gonna take the polish and go ahead and go over this manicure with this let's see how well this gets in here see it's it's, it's lifting up I can see it it's lifting so it's the posh is gonna go everywhere <clears throat> see not very good okay the next thing I think I'm going to do is just get my, let me try it on this other stamper to see if it'll work. I'm not sure. Let's try another one. Because in my head, I was going to do it like I see the other ladies do with the other stencils and, okay, it's sticking on this one. So it was just a stamper okay this is a bit better not much better but I'm gonna do it this way it's it's lifting y'all I really thought I was gonna enjoy working with these but this is not gonna work look at that uh, you see that See how it's just bled all over the place, just like it did my nail. Just like it did my nail. Let me get in focus. Can you see that? Let me back up. See how it just bled everywhere. So some Dollar Tree finds are not worth the dollar. Last night, what I did do which I can kind of see if we can do it on this little palette here. Let's try this. 
trying to make it work y'all see how it's pulling see how that's pulling off of the other one Ugh, what a mess what a mess I wasted a dollar I wasted my money so what I'm gonna do is just do it on this little palette here and then I'm going to go over it with um, clear polish so I'm gonna lift this up and you can't hardly see because I've got it on the white let me see if I can get a black background for you to see it so you can see it does well on this uh, on this on this uh, plastic strip I mean zoom in a little bit on this plastic strip and you see it's focusing see and let me zoom back out there we go so I'm gonna come back after I put a clear tote coat on top and I'm gonna put it on my nail so I'll be back in just a moment all right guys I'm back I think it's had enough time to dry in the meantime I placed some yellow stopper here on my um, ring finger so I'm gonna lift it up with a pair of tweezers let's see if it's gonna work I may have used the wrong top coat for this but we're gonna try it and see uh, Okay, it's coming up okay there we go so we're gonna try to place this on my pinky and let me get the tweezer to kind of manipulate that it's still not as dry as it should be but I'm gonna try it and see we can get a little placement on here yeah it's not gonna be perfect guys because I didn't let it dry enough but just to give you a overview of what you could do with this stencil and what I'm going to do is get my cleanup brush with a little acetone on it to melt that polish away. So yeah, that works okay. I just have to make sure I let it dry a little bit better. Um, but just for testing purposes, I wanted to just, you know, try it out and see with, if this would be the best way to do this particular stencil that I got from the Dollar Tree. So, um... I just have to work on my placement, but it's not too bad. So I think that's the best way or best alternative to use this particular stencil. As I stated before, it does not work well on a stamp. It um, did not work well at all placing it, as you can see on my ring finger, on the nail. And then I, it did the same thing on the stamp. It just smeared all underneath. It doesn't, it doesn't stick very well to the nail or adhere to the nail very well or your stamper. So the best thing to do is if you have a silicone um, mat or a plastic, like this little plastic strip, just leave it on this particular strip and use it as a decal that's going to be the best thing to do with these stencils 
So I just wanted to give you an overall overall review of the stencils that I did get from the Dollar Tree. And I think that's the way I'm going to be using them, is to do them as a decal. Please let me know what you think of this uh, review in the comments section. Also, go ahead and click on that subscribe button and also the notification bell on when I upload new videos. And thanks again for watching.